very rapidly shoot up over the Queen of Pain as he clears through the, the neutrals. But Puppy's going to come in with this smoke. He also has Misery behind him. If they can get a really successful gank, maybe he's already down to low HP, and he's going to be caught by Misery. Just burst it down real quickly, and that's going to be your first blood. And the Y's also going to be caught. The Sonic Wave goes out. They actually hit Siler in the process. Siler's going to be in some trouble. Tries to go for the kill on Weeha, but he's already starting bottling up, and Siler knows he just has to try and escape this situation. But Misery, he's got his sprint ready to go, plus the boots will be able to catch up to Siler eventually. They're going to commit for this kill even further. Siler desperate for some help from the rest of LGD, but doesn't seem to be getting it. No one is around. He's going to pop the ultimate now to try and help give a little bit more distance. The Wiz comes in, helps heal him up a little bit more, but there's just too much damage to the rest of Eternal Emblem. Oh, Pilot Eye coming in. Now DDC and MMY, they're going to be the next target. Team Secret, they're not stopping anytime soon. A good raise comes out for maybe threatening some of these heroes, but it's still MMY going to be dying to the scorched earth. And Eternal Emblem wants DDC as well. The heal comes out for the Chen, keeping them perfectly healthy as they continue. Oh the sustain, God. diving onto LGD, oh, zero to five, making zero to six, his baby's attack. being body blocked beautifully by Puppy, LGD, oh, they blocked just God. six minutes in, already six deaths to Team Secret. The dive continues, man, that global heal just tower. put all the attack. creeps up to full HP, the diving can he takes this tier attack. one tower, Puppy's gonna be super close to mech. If Team Secret just like, start five banning, how Which do you fight it? Chen, <laughs> heal, and mech? That's you, because you, you're lacking damage on LGD. Might find misery though. Oh, they're gonna get the doom out onto Siler. Well, Fortunately, the long duration stun and then the help of the tether will help Siler keep ahead. But the oh, Sonic Wave actually lands on both of them. M and Y, they're just gonna continue to chase down Siler, ensuring this big kill on the carry. Maybe unable to get the deny. They chase down the Wiz as well with the help of Misery. And now Eternal Envy, he's still looking at maybe with the help of Weeha blinking in. But fortunately, maybe does have a haste rune and is actually gonna go for the kill on Weeha. Misses that secondary raise and that's gonna force him back. That definitely would have killed him if he landed that raise. Uh, a lot of potential out of this. Chaos Knight is unlikely to go for an early BKB. Same kind of goes for the SF, so... They are good, we'll have some value. Oh, looks like LGD. They're finally gonna get their first <laughs> kill on the board. You find Pylai die sitting in the trees. It's a big one. Um, any experience that they can choose to be massive this game, actually. Especially when your opponents don't have much farm. They might spot Chaos Knight. Yeah, Pylai die runs right into him. Who gets the stun off first? That'll be Pi. The Hex, now they follow up with Misery, but Siler's gonna be pretty healthy between him and the Dazzle. They're actually gonna relocate him back, which leaves DDC out in the cold. He's just gonna be chased down by the Chen Creeps. Will be eliminated. Killing spree already for Puppy at 12 minutes. It, it is not the time to take with trades. Oh, he does get stunned. Yeah, he's not gonna make it out, so... They get a secondary kill, and that, I mean, the relocate felt a little off point. I, I didn't really see the immediacy needed for a real high damage. And Misery is ready to fish for kills here. Can they find the Shadow Fiend? Yeah, he's going to be able to catch RTK first, starting off with oh. a Slytherin Crush. Okay, Centaur following that one up, and RTK is going to be spotted out. The amp damage, yeah, he's sitting on the side, but okay. <laughs> Eternal is just not messing around with RTK. Throws out the Doom. And why not? It's guaranteed he doesn't naturally farm very well, like yeah. Tiny does. He's all about the kills. Misery literally just read the game well. He said, you're a Chaos Knight with the Wisp. The only way that you're going to get out of control. Oh, oh the relocate. relocate but the, oh, they jump in with the stun. They're going to stop the relocate. Bye-bye, Wisp Chaos Knight. Meanwhile, in the middle lane, they do manage to take out the Doom. Looks like Chaos Knight's still going to die in the bottom lane, but the dive in on Puppy. LGD will be able to take him down. It looks like Puppy just turns around, gets whatever damage he can. RTK, finish him off. Misery hits the stun, but it's not in time. RTK is definitely overcommitted, though, and he will be going down. Nice TP out from maybe with a shallow grave and assistance, and DDC okay. will also get out. So that turns out all right, despite that huge jump in from Misery at the bottom lane. Yeah, that's that's one of those trades saving up more opportunities like that to LGD. And so you're gonna jump in. First reveal of the Orchid is gonna catch DDC potentially by surprise, and with the DD, he may he still be able to uh, shallow grave. Yeah, he's gonna come in for now. TDC okay. does, of course, have that shallow grave. He's gonna TP out now. And uh, Misery just a bit short there on the blink dagger. Won't be able to hit the stun. Meanwhile, in the middle lane, Doom goes out, but it's not in time to stop the lasso. Puppy, oh, he doesn't actually make it over the cliff. And unfortunately, LGD, LGD in a bad position as MMY almost gets bursted down immediately. Relocate up in five seconds. Misery misses the stun, but hits ROTK. Siler gets left behind. And MMY relocate out, back out, barely in time, but it's into the hands of Pylai Die, who just shocks him a new one. LGD, they lose three, and maybe we'll just barely stay ahead of Team Secret. Once again, win the yeah. fight, and they'll take more. So essentially, Chaos Knight's going to have nothing but HP and skill points. But that's not a place Maybe. you can be. Oh, dear. He's really gunning for this one. He's got the weave. 
pick him down. He really wants to be able to get ult good ultimate, but he's already losing DDC, and maybe it's just going to be forced all the way back. Meanwhile, RTK thought it was the time for initiation, but he's going to be lost as Sonic Wave cleans him up. Uh, Siler and the rest of LGD just start backing themselves away, but Pilot, he just jumps on forward, almost trying to finish off this report. He's going to be combo down. Siler comes in. Weha will be able to take out the two supports. Siler now pops his ultimate, trying to catch up with the Blink Strike, trying to get the kill on okay. Weha, but he's still just mages. Siler, you don't want to commit for this one. Yeah, you got the kill, but you've lost your own life. Maybe he comes in. He's going to try one shot. We hot. He gets it. That'll be okay for LGD. But can they stop this push? It's still the Super Wards with the rest of Team Secret nailing that melee racks and only maybe to be able to defend. It looks like Team Secret is going to take the early advantages. Maybe now going to be targeted. Chains on comboed up and maybe just disappears. And Secret once again wipe LGD. They're not giving up yet. No GG. Unless they're just going to do a delayed one. But Secret is going to get this range or this melee barracks at 18 minutes here. Dazzle's going to aggressive. Melee racks is so damn low, but the region is helping out. Now the sun comes out from misery on the two. Oh, he turns around, gets out the doom. Wits is trying to get that extra little bit of damage to send back on Slardar. Now Poppy commits for the melee rack that he gets it. Have me all you want, but I got the objective. LGD failed to defend the melee racks before the 20 minute marker. That was not bad. I would trade. It's pretty good this game because mm -hmm. they are very physical based. Uh, Chaos Knight is mostly physical. Dazzle's physical. Shadow Fiend's a mix. I think it's a good idea. Relocate out. MMY saves just in time before Pilot Eye can get the uh, the disable. Are they actually going to fight around this? LGD are teeping in. ROTK is going to make the initiation here. Looks like they're going to bring the Chaos Knight Wiz back to fold here. Eternal Envy going to be the first one targeted. The Wiz actually comes alone by himself. But oh, jumps on off. ROTK. The ultimate comes out from maybe, but it's still not enough to eliminate Eternal Envy. The Minus Armor is oh, taking him down, but he's got the heals. And now, oh, it's Doom on maybe. He's never going to be able to get away from this. He's just trying to get some damage out. But even his death animation is not going to be enough to get a kill. Slardar, nice stop there from Misery, but LGD have already called it. They know this game is over. They were fighting for scraps. All game long after that oh, six man shit. wipe in the middle lane. Oh, and it on a rampage for Weeha. They, you know, I think the reason they GG'd at that point, it was like they defended, it went pretty well, but then they had a perfect team fight essentially. Yeah. Great Requiem. They almost got a couple kills. And then there's that terrifying moment where Puppy presses his heel and everybody goes from the almost kill to the half HP.